Um, so firstly, with obviously, is the fact that uh, Kenya happens to be the hub for East Africa, which makes it the proper shooting point. So if you want to expand into Uganda, Rwanda, Tanzania, then ideally Nairobi is the hub. So global companies find it easier to start off in Nairobi as they expand into the region. So that's why, and that's why you'll find so many of them making announcements about coming into Kenya. Another thing would be the fact that we have a relatively stable GDP. So it's been growing over the years and it's not going below the 4% mark, which means it's a lucrative market. They will make an in, a profit on their investments. So Sankari is probably one of our most upscale homegrown brands. And when you have a global partner like the Marriott Group, which is one of the biggest in the world, taking interest in a homegrown brand, it means that the Kenyan hotel industry, in terms of local investment, local developers, and local management groups, have reached that level of global acclaim. So we will find more players, more local players being taken up. Like um, the Amber Hotel was taken up by Hilton under the Garden, under the Double Tree brand, and you find Kamkan built their hotel, which is now being managed again by Marriott under the Four Seasons brand. So it just goes to show that local is good enough for international brands to be affiliated with. Which are the major... We would start with Best Western, which is our biggest brand in terms of hotels in the pipeline. So out of the about 14 that are opening next year and 20 that are slated between now and 2025, we have Best Western with six. And then it would be followed closely by Radisson, which has one property to open next year. Then we have Marriott, which of course has signed Sankara. They have the JW coming up. They've already set up their two brands, which is uh, Four Points by Sheraton Airport and Four Points by Sheraton at the Hallingham area. And we also have Hilton, which has uh, debuted its gardening brand in Sub-Saharan Africa at the airport in Nairobi. We have, the, they've taken over Doubletree. They're building their, the tallest building in Upper Hill, which will house their brand Hilton. So we have the four major brands. We have Accor, we have Marriott, we have Hilton, and we have Radisson Group. Yeah.